Hello, in this uh, video we'll go through the installation of Earl uh, on a Windows machine. Uh, so the first step uh, that you will need to do is to go to uh, GitHub to download the installation files and supporting documents. Uh, so using uh, the link uh, over here you can go to the Earl uh, repository uh, online and uh, as you see here there are different uh, number of files and folders that you can download uh, it's up to you for sure to download everything but for the regular user you will just need to download the air installer executable file this one over here in the same time you will need to download the docs folder so this folder contains the supporting documents that you will need to define uh, some components of your uh, project in Earl, uh, as well as the manual uh, inside. So after downloading those uh, to uh, this file and this folder, you can start the installation. Uh, if you are a developer or you are interested in further developing or modifying the MATLAB code, uh, the source code for Earl and sharing it with uh, with others as well. Uh, then you will need to download the SRC or the source uh, folder over here. Uh, this will be the topic of uh, another video that discusses the procedure for uh, developing uh, uh, the functions of Earl. So after downloading uh, the Earl installer, uh, the next step would be to uh, install the program which is uh, a typical procedure so by double clicking the executable file and then uh, proceeding forward with uh, the typical installation procedure uh, here by clicking next uh, specifying the directory for installing uh, the program so this is the uh, default directory which is in the C uh, uh, pass uh, under program files University of Southampton Earl. Uh, you can also choose to add a shortcut to the desktop then proceed uh, essentially if you don't have a MATLAB runtime uh, already installed uh, on your uh, PC uh, then uh, the installation process will require uh, to download and install it before Air is being installed. So if you have an internet connection then uh, you will be prompt to uh, install it here which is around I think uh, around 600 or 700 megabyte that will need to be downloaded and installed. Uh, right now I already have been working uh, with MATLAB and I have MATLAB installed and I have the runtime installed which as it says over here so this uh, step uh, will be skipped. And then I will proceed by clicking next. So this is the confirmation page. I will click next. So the installation, as you see, it takes uh, essentially like 10 or 20 seconds very quickly. Uh, if you are downloading the MATLAB runtime, it might take uh, an additional 15 minutes or so for the download to complete, depending on your bandwidth. After I say finish, as you observe here, I already have the shortcut as I specified uh, on the desktop. And uh, by this, that's it, the installation of Earl is complete. And actually, uh, by double clicking, then uh, Earl will open. For the first time it opens, it might take actually uh, one or a couple of minutes at most uh, to open, but. Uh, Afterward, it should open uh, quicker. So now Earl is open and it's ready for uh, defining a new project and uh, doing a loss assessment, which will be the topic of uh, another video. Thank you.